guys, it's Rachel here today. Um, we are filming in the car because I feel like that's just usually where I vibe the most. So yeah, we're filming in the car today. Um, so I'm driving down to San Diego. If you guys don't know, I feel like I say this on my videos. If you're new, hello, I'm Rachel. Um, I have a boyfriend in San Diego. He goes to STSU. Um, and I'm from, uh, like, LA, Orange County area, so it's like, I don't know, an hour, hour and a half drive, so. Yeah, as you guys can probably tell, my voice is, like, a little off. Um, my voice is gone. I, I, I don't know what happened to it, but yeah. Also, I feel like this is very, like, zoomed in. Um, I got a new phone, and I usually film on my phone. kind of want to just come on here and just, like, talk to you guys, just kind of life update I feel like I just I'm a terrible youtuber now and every video I'm like I'm gonna try to make more videos than I know um but yeah here we are today we're filming so yeah um but I don't know I started school this week um I had like a month off for winter break which was extremely nice but going back was so hard <laughs> I don't know I just couldn't um I couldn't really fathom with it I changed my major um, I'm already a second semester college student, and I'm changing my major, so that's great. Um, but no, it's just crazy because I was like, so like, oh my god, like I love graphic design. I did like, um, the two things I stuck with in high school were cheer and graphic design. Like those, like two, um, things I did for all four years, those were like, kind of like what defined me, like in high school, like who I was, you know? I was an art major, but... I don't know, just the tables have turned, you know, so it's crazy. Um, but yeah, so uh, basically the whole reason why I'm changing my major is because I am lazy. I'm not even going to sit here and be like, oh, well, I like, I don't know, I thought it was like a better option for me. No, I'm just lazy. A Bachelor of Fine Arts, you need 132 units to graduate. And then also, like, in the process, you have to take a bunch of studio classes. And if you guys, I don't know if you guys know what studio classes are. Like, where you sit down and you create art, right? Um, sounds awesome. It's kind of like on my alley. Obviously, I'm an artist. Um, but the thing is, these, like, art classes were, um, or, the, okay, these studio classes are two hours and 45 minutes long. And I, I don't have time for that. <laughs> Especially because there's still three unit classes and I don't know that to me is just outrageous If I'm gonna like sit down and like draw like I'd rather it be like an hour and like 15 minute class like most of my classes are and the three hour classes you have to do twice a week And then so originally this semester I was doing two studio classes twice a week, right? So I was doing a total of uh, 12 hours just in studio classes um, and that is every week that is a lot of hours so um, and also because it's just I need to get all these extra units so I can't take as many classes because I need to get these studio classes taken care of and like the thing for me I have a job like I I want to be able to like spend my free time like hanging out with like my boyfriend and like you know going out and socializing with my friends and stuff like I don't want to be like spending like um, a couple extra hours every week like sitting in like an art class so basically I got lazy because I don't want to sit in you know about three hour long classes twice a week um and I don't want to have all these extra units which might put me into taking another um, semester of college right so I don't know. It would have taken me like four and a half years to graduate um, if, like, I, if I didn't do like summer classes or winter intercession. Um, so I kind of just wasn't down for that. Um, and I was like, okay, well, maybe if I go into marketing, actually, I'm not going to take credit for this. My parents were like, my parents suggested, they're like, oh, like, I don't know. It just seems like kind of a lot. I don't know. That, just because, like, my relationship is something that I value, like, so much, it just kind of made sense for me like you know kind of cut down on like the hours you spend in school so then I can work during like certain hours because it was like getting to the point where I got off it so I went to school from 8 30 to 2 15 non-stop then um 
And plus, I had to get there early to find parking because parking at Cal State Fullerton literally sucks. Um, so I was getting there at like 7.30, so I was there from 7.30 to like 2.15, which I know isn't bad, but it's just like, and then after that, I was going to my job, I was like done at, I'm done at like 6 every day, and then after that, like I go home, I eat, I, um, I like start my homework, you know, sometimes I'll work out if I have time, um, and then, you know, like shower, kind of get ready for bed, and like at that point, like I don't have any time for any of my friends or my boyfriend. And it's just like I know like some people like that's their life and like that's like kind of what happens when you have a job you know you only have so much time and I just want to make sure I'm spending my time doing what I want and, like for me personally like I just kind of want to get through school like I don't know I'm not like sitting here like enjoying the college experience I'm not in a sorority um I mean at times I wish I was I wish like I look at um Chris's life because Chris is dorming and stuff but he's not in a frat or anything but no, I look at his life, I'm like, oh my gosh, he's having so much fun. I'm like, I'm not having that because I have a job and like I am commuting and stuff. And commuting does take a lot of my time too. Like I just, uh, it's crazy. Um, but no, so I mean, I don't know. Like sometimes I, I do think I want that, but like for the most part, like I just kind of, I'm just there to like get my degree and kind of move on with my life, I guess. And I know that sounds like so like, oh my gosh, like why are you rushing your life? But I'm not, it's just I kind of, like, I don't really like school, <laughs> honestly. Like, I don't love school that much. But, like, sitting in class part and learning and, like, when I get home and completing my homework and stuff, like, that's just not my thing. I don't know. <laughs> but, like, I know, like, I have to get through it because I want a new degree. I'm a business major now. I only need 120 units, and that way I don't have to do, like, I'll have to do, like, a few longer classes. Like, I know, like... Like my lab class is gonna be like a few hours long and like I might have to do like a math class that is worth like more credits and that might be like um like a longer time so like these like three hour classes which like I understand which is fine but it's just like this way like I'm only doing um the hour and 15 minute classes twice a week and I have like such I have such a nice schedule now um so no, I love it, and it's gonna allow me to go to work earlier, and then I'll have a little more time to, you know, hang out with my friends and, you know, talk to my boyfriend and, like, really focus on school and, like, kind of just, like, get all my stuff done. So I made a homemade uh, hot matcha latte. It's a vegan, too, so we're using reusable cups, going vegan, like, go, go Earth, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, so that's just, I kind of always want to go into, like, advertising, so I feel like marketing is, like, advertising, I feel like that would go, like, hand in hand with graphic design. So, um, another thing I've been, like, getting a lot of questions about is, um, my skin. So, I, as we all know, my skin journey, like, I've had acne for, like, a long time. My skin actually looks, like, really good right now. Um, I'm also wearing a different foundation. As you guys can tell, it's a little bit dark for me, so. I don't know I've always like struggled with like acne and stuff and it's not fun I don't know like it just doesn't make me feel good <laughs> or anything so. my senior year I um, went to the dermatologist they put me on pills so I started taking doxycycline um, so I never really gave you guys an update with it and I've been getting like a lot of questions and stuff so I'm gonna kind of address it here so you're welcome um, so yeah I um, I was on the pills for about like a month and then like I ran out of my bottle and then at that point like I wasn't really seeing any results like at all and I was like okay like I know like usually like when you take medication you don't really start seeing results until you are um, until you're like I don't know two to four months in or something I should have still breaking out a lot um, and then decided to like take me off the pills because I don't know my mom wasn't too fond about me like a 17 year old girl being on like medication right like especially if I like I don't know she just sees it if you don't really like need it like why be on it and like just because it's like internal it's just I don't know it's just a, it's a little like scary sometimes so I don't know my mom just like didn't really want me on that 
and like I get it like I don't know just anything you have to put like inside your body like I, I just you want to like really watch what you're putting inside of your body what I'm doing currently I decided to try Kirology. Um, I wish this was sponsored but it's not uh, but no I feel like everyone everyone literally talks about Kirology, so I'm like oh my gosh like I see it in like my eyes all the time so you know marketing right um, so anyways I caved in and I did like the free trial or whatever. Um, I'm actually really liking them. I don't know like what it is about them, but like my skin, like even I'll show you guys like like a little up close later, or maybe I'll do like a clip without makeup in a little bit. Um, like here, I'm a little bit broken out still, like a little bit on my just like kind of my cheeks are my troubled areas right now, which is weird because I my cheeks were never my troubled areas until like kind of end of senior year so so far i've been enjoying it i'm not gonna like say like oh yeah like just to hop on this um because i've not given it the full amount of time so i don't know but so far my skin looks phenomenal i wake up it feels great it feels moisturized um my skin is super dry so i've been finding like it's so hard to like keep my skin moisturized and i don't know the moisturizer that they even have is phenomenal so i don't know but the actual like prescribed stuff they give you like uh, it's doing something for me i don't know how it's working so yeah so far i really like it um, a lot of you guys have been asking about like my teeth and my retainer and stuff so um my front teeth have actually not moved here i'll show you guys like my teeth later but um my front teeth have actually not really moved at all i kind of noticed in a little bit my bottom teeth um, my bottom teeth kind of shifted a little bit, <laughs> which I'm not proud of, but I've been wearing my retainer, and at, for my first year, I was supposed to wear my retainer all day, all night, and did I do that? No, but do I think it affected my teeth? Not really. Um, I still wore my retainer every night for the first year, even though I was supposed to be wearing it during the day too, because I couldn't talk with it, and I still can't talk with it because I only wear it when I'm sleeping now. Um, so yeah, and then I kind of have been bad about wearing it, and then I noticed my bonnet teeth are moving, so I've been trying to wear it again, um, but yeah, so my bonnet teeth have kind of actually shifted back since I've started wearing my bottom retainer a lot more, and my top retainer literally still fits, so yeah. I actually have my retainer with me, so, um, I'll show you guys my teeth now, and then I will put in my retainer, because a lot of you guys have been asking me about it. <laughs> yeah, my retainer still fits. Jeez. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, so that's pretty much it for the video. You know, we talked a little bit about uh, my school, how I changed my major, you know, talked a little bit about my skin and like my teeth, you know. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, hopefully I answered a lot of you guys' questions because I just kind of want to like address stuff. I mean, no one really asked about like school or anything, but like I thought that might be kind of interesting to talk about. But yeah, no, hopefully um, I address some of you guys' questions that you guys have been asking me for a long time. Um, so yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you make a huge thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my channel if you guys have not already. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!